With Talion Interact's WhatsApp API solution, your business gets access to a shared team inbox connected to a single WhatsApp business API number where your teammates can collaborate to manage customer chats. In the shared team inbox, you can check the status of all the messages that you have sent from Tally Prime, reply to your customers, assign chats to your team members, add labels to chats and filter chats on basis of those labels, add tags and notes on customers, change the WhatsApp opted status of customers and mark customers as spam. All messages sent from Tally Prime will appear in the shared team inbox. As shown here, a double tick will appear if the message has been delivered and not yet read by the end customer. If the message has been read, then a blue double tick will appear. Note that if the customer's read receipts are off on their WhatsApp, blue ticks won't appear here. If a customer replies to you from their WhatsApp app, the reply will appear in the shared team inbox. You can then type a free form reply to them and send it like this. You can also attach media files to your message. You can even select a pre-saved quick reply like this and send it in one click. If it has been more than 24 hours since the customer's last message to you, you can only send them a pre-approved WhatsApp template. To send a WhatsApp template message from the inbox, click on Choose Template in the Composer area and select a template from the list of approved templates. If the selected template has a variable like 1, you will need to specify the value of that variable. You can choose to map 1 to a pre-saved contact field like phone number, name, email, etc. Or you could simply select Use Constant Value and type out the value for 1 in the text box to the right. In the share team inbox, you can assign chats to other team members who are also added in the account. The chat will be assigned to them and will appear in their U section. You can also add labels to chats and filter chats on basis of those labels. To add labels on a chat, simply click on add label to your conversation below the name of your customer and then type the label that you want to add. To filter chats by a particular label, click on the filter icon and select the label from the drop down. While talking to customers in the share team inbox, you might want to add some details about the customers which other team members can refer to. You can add details via tags and notes. Let's look at tags first. Tags are simple words or terms that you can use to identify a customer. Click on edit. Next in the pop-up that opens, type the tag that you want to create and then click on click here to create new tag. After doing this, you will see a green banner on the top right saying tags added successfully. You will still need to select the tag and save it for this particular customer. Notes are detailed write-ups on a particular customer. You can use notes for sharing detailed context regarding a customer with your team members. Notes can be added from the inbox in two ways. From the composer area, simply click on notes and type down the note. Then click on send. A note added like this will only appear in the chat window. Although the note is shown in the chat window, it won't be sent to the customer. It will only be visible to your team members in the shared team inbox. You can also create notes from the notes smart card on the right. Simply click on the yellow text box to start typing the note and then click on add. A note added in this way will only be found in the notes smart card and will not appear in the chat window. From the inbox, you can also change the WhatsApp opted status of your customer like this. After the WhatsApp opted status is marked as no, any message that you try to send to the customer from Tally Prime will fail to get sent. If you don't want to receive communications from some customers, you can mark them as spam like this. Chats of these customers would then only appear in the spam section of your inbox.